seeking care instead of a cure for depression. Okay, so if depression is a disease, what's a cure? If we're only that simple, I mean, I get why anyone would be interested in a cure for depression. Depression is really awful to live with. When you're not feeling sad, you're feeling numb, drained, and empty. Depression makes its way into every corner of your life. You feel tired, you ache, you feel like you're alone. Is there a cure for depression? And if those symptoms I just listed sound familiar, should you wait for the cure? Maybe not. And our video will tell you why. What is depression? Depression is a chronic mental disorder with distinct mental and physical symptoms. And there's several different kinds of depression. But when most people are talking about depression, they're likely thinking of major depressive disorder or clinical depression. Depression can occur once in a person's life, although most people experience depression multiple times. Symptoms last most of the day, every day. They include intense feelings of sadness, hopelessness, and emptiness. Sleep disturbances are common with depression, and most people lose interest in doing things they used to enjoy. Anxiety also frequently occurs alongside depression as well. And there's even more physical and mental symptoms of depression. These are just some of the better known ones. Is there a cure for depression? At present, no. While there's occasionally a new story about that new drug or this certain supplement, depression can't be cured in the usual, traditional sense of the word. However, depression can be treated. And there's a variety of ways depression symptoms can be treated and managed. For some, it's exercise. For others, it's an antidepressant. Here at the Edge Treatment Center, we use a variety of methods to treat depression, including talk therapy. Helping people safely explore the roots of their mood disorder is a great way to treat the problem at its source. But there's an important thing to remember about depression treatment. It takes time to identify your triggers. It takes time for your body to adapt to antidepressant drugs. It takes time for therapy to make a difference. And compared to a cure, it can feel like a lifetime. But here's why getting treatment for depression now is better than waiting for a cure that's not likely to appear. Like any chronic condition, depression often gets worse with time. People struggling with untreated depression often experience more severe symptoms. Trying to self-medicate with substances like alcohol and often engage in self-harm behaviors. A study conducted by the University of California, Irvine in 2023, found that untreated depression can cause physical changes in our brains, shrinking brain areas, and making it harder for the different areas in our brain to communicate with each other. Look at it this way. Sure, treating depression effectively can be hard work, but you know you're gonna feel better eventually. Isn't that better than just waiting? I'm Jeremy Artst, and seeing people get help and build happy and new lives for themselves is my passion. It drives my work at the Edge Treatment Center. If you're dealing with depression, you likely feel like you're alone and nobody understands. And the thing is, you're not. All you need is a little help. And if you've struggled or are struggling with depression, how are you holding up? Any tips? Share them in the comments below. Depression's a treatable mental health disorder. Reach out to the Edge Treatment Center today at 844-590-0403 to learn more about our effective treatment programs like addiction, mood disorders like depression, and more. Thanks for watching our video. Hit those like and subscribe buttons, and I'll see you next time.